I was the eager boy. But I'm settled. Five pounds, please. If you don't mind, Mr. Bunkle. Cash upon the like. Cash upon the like. Mrs. Sowerberry! What is it? Will you have the goodness to come here a moment, my dear? Well, what do you want? What is it? Dear, yeah, I've told Mr. Bumble that. Hello, Mr. Bumble. Hello, Mr. Sowerberry. That we may consider taking in this boy there. Dear me, he's rather small. Yes, he's rather small. <laughs> There's no denying it. But he'll grow, Mr. Sowerberry. He'll grow, I dare say he will. I'm not a bit of an on our drink. They're a waste of time, these workhouse boys. Always possible to keep in what they work. Still, you men always think you know what's best. What are you going to do with him, Henry? There's an expression, my dear. Melancholy on his face. Just quite curious. <laughs> I dare say he'd become a grand coffin follower. A what? No, 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 no. I don't mean a regular coffin follower to follow the notes. Just for children's breakfast. It'd be nice to have a coffin follower in proportion, sweet. A superb effect. The more I think about it. For once, Henry. Just for once. You might have a good idea. Very well then, boy. What's your name? Oliver. Oliver Twist, ma'am. A singular name. Yes. And one of my choosing. Yours, Mr. Bumble. Mine, Mr. Sowerberry. How's that, Mr. Bumble? The boy's mother came to us destitute, brings the child into the world, takes one look at him, and promptly dies without giving for any name or address. Dear, dear. <laughs> well, then, Oliver Twist, do you think you could look like that man up there? I suppose, if I had a black hat. Never mind my black hat. Get the top hat, Henry. These things must be done proper and correct. Henry! Henry, really, it takes you twice as long to do anything as anyone else. Yes, yes. Could you keep that expression for a long time, boy? With a crowd, can you? Yes, ma'am. He's a born undertaker's beauty. I can see him in a black session. Following me, I love you, girl. Session beats me, just beats me in a suitable expression. There'll be horses with tall black girls to escort us to the family.
dad say the boy ain't too dainty to eat him, are you, boy? No, Mom. Are you done? Yes, Mom. I'm glad to hear it. Get to bed, Henry. Don't just stand there gawking, Charlotte. Now then, your bed's over there. I don't suppose you mind sleeping among coffins, do ya? Well, it doesn't matter whether you do or you don't. You can't sleep nowhere else. The only thing that can happen, for all I know of, is to bring him back for a day or so, till he's a little starved down. I'll keep him on rule. He comes from a bad family. What's going on in me, father? Bad boy. Only that. You've no idea what he's been up to. We've had to look him up. Never in my life. Now, you're a nice fella, aren't you? Hey, call my brother nice. And so what we did, you little wretch? She probably deserved what was said and worked. 